Sup guys, sup. I just, I will just say right now, Breadstick got a lot better than I expected. I still won, but that was a lot closer than I expected. No, Breadstick has been playing great this turn. Yeah. I was upset. I was, I was one miss up smash from taking him away out super early though. Wait, taking over who? Taking out uh, Breadstick two rounds earlier though. Uh. No, I I was, a lot of I like the AZ scene is really nice. Zora, Bread, a lot of people have been really improving. A yeah. lot. I I was one downer away from like potentially beating Chompers. We always have clencher sets. Mm -hmm. But speaking of Chompers, him versus Blue. This has been historically Blue favored. Yeah, like, and I know Chompers just hates the Raster matchup. Understandably, this matchup no, is yeah. not very easy at all. Not at all. Like one of dash or one of dash attacks. One of Edelus' yeah. best tools is like the options he has off the dash attack. Wave that you know, dash attack, wave dash back. Mm -hmm. You know, dash attack, just regular nair, late nair. There's the so many things you can do out of it. The key for Chompers, I think, is gonna be like little mistakes like that, like the missed up B by blue, is that Chompers needs to capitalize those as much as possible in a bad matchup. You need to get the max out of your opponent's mistakes. Oh yeah. I've had to play Zedder Claren before, trust me, I understand Ooh. that feeling. Oh, that's that one's a, that's a yikes matchup right there. Well, I lost game one to Kiwi, then I went Orcane. Just fuck that. I, Anyways, yeah. enough about me. <laughs> um, so what I was saying is, uh, the Raster, or Raster, Edelus does very well off of his dash attack, and a lot of different mix-ups he has, stuff like that. The thing is, Raster has a forward air, and yeah. it's, pretty, it's pretty rough for good old Bear. Also, Raster can just like, he can do an aerial and not have to fully commit to it because he's so aerial mobile. So, Blue's punish game is nuts. Very. The one that it's, I would like to see, um, I know he loves like the long wave dash, but because of forward air, I would like to see uh, Chumper shorten up his wave dash and stay a little bit out of that forward air range to try and bait Blue a little bit more. Yeah. So, ooh. But that punish game that Blue has is just so, so tight. So Chompers is probably going to switch. He usually tries other... Oh, is he going to stick it out? He usually, he usually gives it two games. He usually doesn't switch to a game three. I've, I've seen, seen him do it as, after one game, but I mean... I just, I just, I feel like it's, I feel like because, like, he know he knows if he wins this monthly, is a good chance of moving up in the PR. He wants to stick with his, like, best character and his best guy. Sure. I mean, but also, if you have a character that does better, like, it's better mm. to do that. But the thing is, his secondaries historically hasn't done no. that much better, if at all. So it's like, I th I agree that it's best for him to just stick it out with Edelus. It's not that bad. Mm. Like, for me, 6-4 is worth, like, which is what I think it is. Yeah. Is, like, I don't think that's quite, like, pick a secondary level. No, of bad. I agree. I think, right, if, if any worse than that... Yes. Mm -hmm. I do think Blue's more frequency at tournaments is going to make Chumper start to develop uh, a better secondary, a more firm secondary character, though. So I think eventually he might get tired of this matchup. And just at least every once in a while I want to mix it up. Yeah, that's fair. Anyway. Oh, Blue keeping that pressure on the edge, just not letting Chumpers get back at all. Jeez, Blue is a monster, dude. Yes, he hits you. He hits you once, and he either gets fat damage or he gets your stock. Yeah, like that's the definition of a good punish game. That down air was interesting. I don't know what his thought process was, but he didn't get punished. For yeah, it, but so. he wasn't in a punishable situation, so why not just just for the hell of it? I guess I just thought another fair would be better, but mm. I'm not the raster man here. Yeah. Also, Chomper is normally it doesn't really show it now. He's pretty sick on this stage. Like, when I played him, I played him today. I won game one and he took me here. And I like the stage. And he two stalked me still. So. Nah. He's, he's I know nuts. he's a big fan of this stage, but the matchup is still very hard on this one, regardless. Oh, I kind of wish he didn't up B and just, uh, or up special and just immediately go down and down air, but I mean. Let's see. Will Chompers stick with the Edelist for game three or will he try and switch to a second? Oh, all right. It. He's sticking it out. I, re I respect it. I, respect I approve. It. I mean, if you're if you're gonna want a solo main Edelus, I don't know if he wants to solo main or not. Mm -hmm. Then you're gonna have to deal with this eventually. Oh, let's go. This is, I think, the best stage in like almost every way imaginable. 
Agreed. This is what my Twitter banner has on it. Custom made Twitter banner. Shout out to Lil Fox. But, um. Blue? I like how he spaces himself in this matchup. His neutral is insane. Put the eye out by uh, Chalmers there in a little, little longer. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, I like that parry on the slipstream. Ah. Still living. Oh. Oh, good fair. I actually like Chompers going to the stage quite a bit. It kind of... It has the big stage, kind of like Ethereal Gates, but I yeah. feel like the platforms are a little bit nicer for him here. I, I mean, I might be wrong, but... I'd imagine having oh, like more platforms to get ice on can help. Mm -hmm. And if he it needs to get armor... It just makes less areas to land safe for us. Yeah. yeah, and it's also like if he needs to get armor, he can go like further out of Blue's mm -hmm. way than he would have to on Gates. Yeah. Because the top platform is just so much further away than what the other platforms would be, so... He's doing well this time so far. Now granted... Okay. He didn't get comboed to death, but he did take a lot of damage. Edelis can make this up, though. Look at this punish. Ooh. Just made it up right there. Yeah. Good patience by Choppers, though. Yeah. And honestly, I feel like patience is one thing you need in this match with Edelis. It was like, oh, that was desperate. He doesn't get punished too hard for it, though. Yeah, he doesn't die from it, which is... Very fortunate. Yeah, very fortunate for him. Nice. Yeah. Blue cleans up that stock. I noticed anytime Blue doesn't like combo him to death, he's just catching his landings a lot. Mm -hmm. Which kind of makes sense, you know, Edelus can't come down that easily. Yeah. Like, he has options, but like, some of them are kind of like, oh, okay. Oh, I don't like that F-Smash. No. Little, little fishy right there. Raster is a character you want to be careful when you try to catch his landing. Aerial mobile, lots of jumps, and that's it. And that'll be it. That's a pretty hard 3-0 for Lou.